In this video, I'm gonna show you guys how we turn this Toyota MR2 into what appears to be a K-swapped Volkswagen bug. We had to widen it 10 inches and it took a brutal two and a half years to complete. <laughs> I was going to talk over this entire video and explain all the steps it took to make this Frankenstein, but because I don't have a soothing Australian voice that people like to listen to, I'm just going to sum it up now. This was a pain in the butt. I don't know what I was doing, but somehow it kind of worked out. Enjoy. I am 1000% not cutting this bug. 1000%. I know I said I wasn't going to talk, but this is a really good time to tell you guys that the MR2 and the Bug have identical wheelbases, so this project just seemed like it had to be done, and, uh, okay, bye now. Thanks. I'll see you later. Enjoy the music I've chosen for you. Okay, one more time, I promise. I uh, just want to say I made a lot of Volkswagen purists really mad during the duration of this build, and uh, Hux Racing is awesome, and they're the first company to sponsor us. Okay, bye. Remember that one time I promised not to interrupt anymore? Well, I had to interrupt to tell you that Team Olympus did a fantastic job on this roll cage, and without their help, this chassis would be nothing more than a limp taco. This is proof that I bled on this build. You're welcome.
I'm just not gonna promise anymore. Sorry, that song was a little too sappy. Here's something a little more upbeat. Since the song ended, I figured this would be a good time for me to come back. I painted the whole car in black Tamco direct to anything epoxy and then painted the whole thing blue and then sprayed it black again and then wet sanded to bring forth what you see here, which is my attempt at a fake patina and I like it. And if you don't, that's okay because it's not your car, but I like it and you should too. Two things real quick. One, we ran out of time on the dyno because I was running behind, so we only made 340 wheel horsepower. We're going back to make more. Second thing, I don't know how to drive yet. But while I was learning how to drive, a talented photographer or two got some shots of me that make me look professional. So as far as Facebook knows, I'm really good at it.
Well, that's all I got for you. So I hope you enjoyed two and a half years of pain and a final result in 10 minutes. If you guys like what you saw, please consider clicking that stupid button that everyone tells you to click. It starts with an S and ends with an IBE. That one, that'd be great. Thanks, guys.